So, President Zelensky, the uh, Vladimir, it's a great honor. Uh, air defense is critical to protect uh, the cities, uh, the, the, the economy, uh, the critical infrastructure of Ukraine, uh, and that helps them to, 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 to help themselves, because then the economy can function, then, uh, then, then things can work in Ukraine, and that will help uh, the Ukrainians to also produce, uh, to trade, uh, to function as, as, uh, as a normal country, and that will uh, increase their ability to finance and to provide uh, also ammunition uh, themselves for the uh, the, uh, the war. What we are seeing now is that President uh, Putin is preparing once again to use winter as a weapon of war, uh, meaning uh, attacking uh, uh, the energy system, uh, the gas infrastructure. We need to prevent that. Uh NATO allies have stepped up production. Um, we have now 2.5, 2.4 billion in what we call framework contracts for increased uh, ammunition production, uh, out of which 1 billion is firm uh, contracts. And we are constantly working on ramping up production to enable Ukraine to uh, continue to fight uh, this just war and to continue to liberate the land. President Zelensky, Vladimir, welcome to NATO. Your fight is our. There are priorities air defense systems defending so it's not just basic words we have very concrete things and we need them in very concrete you know and very concrete geographic points on our land to save energy network to save people to save grain for uh, transit grain uh, for, to save these routes for africa asia for the world so it's it's important that long distance missiles or long distance weapon doesn't matter how you call the problem how 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 to get it yes because you need this especially for the one reason to push russia out of our land and i think these two things are the most important and the third thing how to defend just to stay each day and defend we have not to give possibility for aggressors, so we are in war, so we understand what does it mean terroristic attacks, such victims, tra tragedy. My, my recommendation, if I can use this word, my recommendation for the leaders of the world. I remember the first days of our full scale war. It began from terroristic attacks from Belarus by missiles, then Russian army and you know that was the biggest tragedy what we had and so many dying people and so many deaths so many and uh, it's so it was very important not to be alone I am from Kyiv uh, Ukrainian soldiers on the ground cite a severe lack of then we will also address the incident uh, in the uh, Baltic uh, Sea uh, with the damage uh, caused to uh, uh, critical uh, undersea infrastructure. Uh, I spoke with President uh, Sauli Ninisto and Prime Minister uh, Kaya Kalas yesterday and we are in close contact. The important thing now is to establish what happened uh, and uh, how this could happen. If it is proven to be a deliberate uh, attack on uh, NATO critical infrastructure, uh, then this will be uh, of course serious, uh, but it will also be met by a united and determined response uh, from uh, NATO.